There are rituals. We had, can I tell you something? We had yeah. sexual rituals that were so ludicrous. Oh. Kelly Ripa and Mark Consuelos are opening up about the steamy side of their marriage. On Wednesday, the 52-year-old morning talk show host debuted her new podcast, Let's Talk Off Camera. And her first guest was her husband. The couple chatted about multiple parts about their long-lasting marriage throughout the episode, alongside their couple's therapist including how they made long distance work during the pandemic. We actually, because of the pandemic, spent the longest time together than we've ever spent in our marriage in total. But then soon, like after the first wave, I went back to work. I was stuck in um, Canada for close to 10 months and we saw each other maybe two weeks over 10 months. So I agree with you. I think if things are good, and you're and you're with each other, and I, I think it can be true also when you're apart. Um, if it's a good marriage and a strong marriage, um, it can withstand that because we were gone. I was, I mean, we've never spent that much time apart. I was going to ask you, how did you how did you survive that separation? How did you stay connected? We would were FaceTime. there rituals that yeah. you followed? Yeah, there were definitely rituals. After Mark revealed they did have quote rituals that they followed. Kelly didn't hold back with the dirty details. There are rituals we had. Can I tell you something? We had yes. sexual rituals that were so ludicrous oh, no over, kidding. over FaceTime. But I became so alarmed at my appearance <laughs> over FaceTime that I started rigging the computer to hang from a ladder. <laughs> I'm not kidding. I hung the computer over a ladder so that I could look up to Mark so that he did not have to see what gravity was actually doing. So I, you know, you, you get really close to yourself in, in uh, situations where you're separated from your for husband sure. for long periods of time. Yeah. Besides the sexy FaceTime calls, the couple revealed one other sweet ritual that they religiously followed. Well, do you remember yeah. I had bought us these uh, bracelets? So Mark wears a bracelet, I wear a bracelet. And anytime I touch my bracelet, his bracelet in Vancouver would touch him. It would vibrate. I, I love that. And so where I, do you, you get know, that? It's, it's <laughs> called Bond Touch. Yeah. I don't, it's, this is not an ad. It's called Bond Touch. Yeah. It's a really incredible. It was really nice. Yeah, it's a very nice device. And so it would like let us know that the other person was thinking about them. That's an amazing way to stay connected. Yeah. I mean, really. Well, Mark and Kelly talked about the many imperfections of their relationship, they've been committed to making their marriage work since 1996. And now they are co workers. The Riverdale actor is replacing Ryan Seacrest on ABC's Live with Kelly and Ryan, which is now being called Live with Kelly and Mark. Access Hollywood chatted with Mark recently at the 2023 Vanity Fair Oscar after party, and he shared the secret to working with his wife. Congratulations. Oh, you you so and much. your wife are about to take that national stage. Uh, yeah. Live with Kelly and Mark? Is that live the new Kelly and Mark. Yeah. Oh, absolutely. Live with Kelly and Mark. Yeah. The great social experiment of, uh, of the moment. I mean, look, you two are no strangers to working together. Yeah. We've seen you over the years. We've loved seeing you together over the years. What is the key to working with your wife? Um, it's really, I got to tell you, she, you know, she makes it look so easy. Um, it's not. What she does is really, really hard. Working with her and stepping in, um, it, it, she always keeps the ball in the air. Um, I don't know. We just have, we have very different points of view. Um, I'm not too, I'm not going to be scared to express them. I never am when I'm on that show. And we just have a blast. What are you bringing that the audience might not be used to seeing, but when um, Mark Consuelos pulls up, get ready, because here it I comes. I don't know. No, I mean, I, I don't want to, you know, it's, it's like I said, I've, I've been saying, it's such a such an iconic show. Um, I think that, you know, I'm, I just hope, just want to just want to keep, keep, keep it on the train, yeah. keep the tracks, keep it on the train on the tracks. We also talked with Kelly about how she plans to balance work and home life now that her hubby will always be by her side. And I can't wait for Mark now to be in the chair yeah, with Mark. you. <laughs> What's great is like Mark and I are going to literally have to separate yeah. so that we are, so that he doesn't know what I've got in store with so there could be some surprises. So there's surprises for Mark. Okay. Yeah. So any rules of engagement, like anything, like we don't talk about work past 5 p.m. or. Yeah, I mean, we, you know, Mark and I worked together for many years on All My Children, and then we worked together on Hope and Faith, and we were very deliberate in our 
not bringing work home with us. Work was work and home was home. Right. And so we don't, like, separation of church and state. So we've, we right. actually know what it means to have that mm. sort of, um, you know, cutoff point where but it's I like. I can't wait to watch it. <laughs> oh, he can't wait for our first fight. I can't wait to see the first disagreement. There are going to be side texting. Oh, no, no, like, I'll know the body language. Believe me, I know the body language very well. No, he does. He, no, I know like, it all. He understands <laughs> when, like, Mark has hosted in the past. He, like, knows where all the, because so he'll. I know the trigger points. He'll, he'll like, j drag us into a group text. Mm -hmm. That is, he's, I love that. Yeah. That's hysterical. You he's the Andy, he's language. the Andy Cohen of our life. <laughs> he's, like, the real housewife. He's going to host the reunion specials.